enjoying Mowgli's 4D jungle adventure. All right, we're currently on our way to the St. Louis Zoo. I'm really excited about it. Hopefully see some alligators today, maybe some other reptiles and some monkeys, all sorts of cool stuff. I hear there's some elephants and lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. All right, buddy, I got my nephew JJ right here. Uh, you excited to go to the zoo today? Yeah. What are your favorite animals you're excited to see? Wow, those are some cool animals. It says this is where the elephants are, but I don't see them. They could be hiding though. It's a real possibility. Legs, head, personal belongings inside the train, no eating or drinking while on board. We're now headed through the third tunnel of our journey. Coming out of the tunnel. Is that cool, Jay? Yeah, right. It's the 1904 World Fair flight cage. Somebody's missing a horn. Hey, little buddy. How are you? Lion's taking a nap. Probably, probably worn out from eating a bunch of food. These little guys can be very dangerous. Hold on, Jay. Very yeah. dangerous. Let me see. They're not even real. Oh, my wow, this is awesome. Look at the baby. Look at the baby. Oh, my goodness. Well, it's been a very exciting adventure so far here at the St. Louis Zoo. I'm taking a nice sitting break because there's nothing wrong with taking a break and just sitting down and enjoying some sun. Get a load of this guy. What's up, buddy? How you doing? Holy smokes. Move ever so softly. No big movements.
What's up, guys? Hello. Hello back. How are you today? Did you guys eat lunch yet? I hope it's not me. Look at that ostrich. You know I'm tall, but I'm not nearly as tall as the giraffes. Where's Caesar? There he is. <coughs> it's like the plot of an Alfred Hitchcock movie. You know, they say the early bird gets the worm, but what about the early Rob? What does he get? Coffee and nicotine. Somebody's getting work done, cleaning themselves. Scrub a dub dub. You know who they remind me of? Who? It's time for another sitting break. The older you get, the more you gotta sit. Those gotta be the coolest hairdos I've ever seen. The best part of the day, the gift shop. Walking over the bridge, gotta get up on out of here. Until next time, St. Louis Zoo. St. Louis Zoo, where you gonna have some fun, see some animals. All right, it's been a long day at the zoo. I've had a great time. I'm exhausted, heading back to the car now. My three biggest takeaways from the zoo today are as follows. First and foremost, going to a zoo about once a decade is plenty enough zoo time, trust me. Number two, I'm really starting to understand the anti-zoo angle. Having animals in cages with popcorn being thrown at them with a bunch of snot-nosed kids running around complaining how they want cotton candy while people just stare at them all day long and take pictures while they're caged? I don't think that's what animals were brought on this planet for. I don't think that's what animals were brought on this planet for at all. And number three, why ruin an amazing day at the zoo by walking? I think they should give out golf carts to every single family that comes here. I've walked seven and a half miles today. There's no need for that. Get in a golf cart, jet from the polar bears all the way over to the kangaroos and everything in between. Well, that's my show. Be safe, be well. We'll talk to you soon, and until next time, take it easy.